Are you ready for adding a new video? Population decline is common in many U.S. states and countries around the world. While some places see fewer people, others see more people moving in. Recent studies and surveys show that many people are leaving certain states. There are many reasons for this like the high cost of living, lack of job opportunities, bad weather, and even heavy traffic. Today we're going to look closely at 15 states to understand why people are leaving and where they might be moving to instead. Number 15. Minnesota. Minnesota is famous for its beautiful landscapes with countless lakes, lush forests, and expansive parks. The state's population is around 5.7 million, with most people living in the Twin Cities area, which includes Minneapolis and St. Paul. However, despite its natural beauty, Minnesota has seen a significant number of residents leaving the state. Approximately 19,400 people moved out of Minnesota. This trend of domestic outmigration has been consistent over the past few years. For instance, Minnesota had a 56% outbound rate among top states people are leaving. Minnesota has some of the highest taxes in the nation, including income and property taxes. The state income tax rate can go up to 9.85%, one of the highest in the country. The winters in Minnesota are long and severe, with heavy snowfall and freezing temperatures. This can be particularly challenging for older adults and those who prefer milder climates. The cost of living in some areas, especially housing, is relatively high. For example, the average rent for a one-bedroom apartment in Minneapolis is around $1,500 per month. This can be a burden for families and individuals looking for more affordable living options. While the Twin Cities offer many job opportunities, rural areas may not. This disparity can push people to seek better job prospects in other states. Many people leave Minnesota in search of warmer climates and lower living costs. States like Florida are popular destinations for Minnesotans because of their milder weather and lower tax rates. Some people move to be closer to family or for personal reasons, such as retirement or lifestyle changes. Why are thousands of residents choosing to leave Maryland despite its picturesque landscapes and vibrant communities? Stay tuned. Number 14. Maryland. Maryland, a small state on the east coast of the United States, offers a mix of landscapes, from sandy beaches on the Atlantic coast to rolling hills and forests in the west. With a population of around 6 million people, Maryland is known for its diverse cultures and communities. However, approximately 30,000 people left Maryland, continuing a trend seen in recent years. Maryland's cost of living is notably high particularly in areas close to Washington, D.C. and Baltimore. Housing, utilities, and groceries are expensive, straining family budgets. According to the U.S. Census Bureau, Maryland's median home value is much higher than the national average. For instance, the median home price in Maryland is about $400,000, compared to the national median of approximately $300,000. This disparity makes home ownership challenging for many residents. Taxes in Maryland are another significant factor driving people away. T. Maryland's personal income tax starts at 2% for taxable income over $1,000 and goes up to 5 and 3 quarters percent for incomes over $250,000. The sales tax is 6%, and local counties can add their own taxes, pushing the total tax burden up to 8% for some people. Additionally, local counties impose their own taxes, which can bring the total tax burden to as high as 8% for some residents. Traffic congestion is a major issue in Maryland, especially in Baltimore and areas near Washington, D.C. Long commute times are common, which can be frustrating and reduce the quality of life. The Texas A.M. Transportation Institute reports that the D.C. Metropolitan area, including parts of Maryland, is one of the most congested in the country. Residents often spend over one hour commuting each way, making daily travel a significant hassle. Many Maryland residents are moving to states with lower costs of living and taxes, like Virginia and North Carolina. These states offer more affordable housing, lower taxes, and less traffic congestion, providing a better overall quality of life. For example, the cost of living in North Carolina is significantly lower, with housing costs about 30% cheaper than in Maryland. Number 13. New Mexico. Known for its stunning and diverse landscapes, from deserts to mountains and forests, New Mexico offers breathtaking scenery. But despite its natural beauty, New Mexico is facing a significant outmigration issue. New Mexico's population is around 2.1 million people, with Albuquerque being the largest city in Santa Fe, the state capital, renowned for its rich art and culture. However, in the year 2024, approximately 6,500 people left New Mexico. 
This continues a trend from recent years. Between the year 2020 and the year 2022, the state saw a decrease of about 5,046 residents, indicating a persistent pattern of outmigration. One of the main reasons people are leaving New Mexico is its weak job market. The state has limited opportunities, especially for skilled workers and recent graduates. Many young professionals move to places like Texas and Colorado, where the job markets are more robust and offer better career prospects. According to a study by Future Focused Education, many young professionals report that New Mexico companies are less likely to hire graduates from boot camps or non-traditional backgrounds, pushing them to seek opportunities elsewhere. New Mexico also struggles with a history of poorly performing schools. This is a major concern for families, leading many to relocate to states with better educational systems. The state's education system has consistently ranked low in national assessments, contributing to the exodus of residents seeking better opportunities for their children. High crime rates, especially in urban areas, coupled with a significant poverty rate, are also driving people away. Issues related to drug abuse and generational poverty make certain areas less desirable to live in. These factors contribute to the overall perception that New Mexico is not a safe or economically stable place to live. Before we move on to the 12th state, we want to hear your thoughts on the three major states I just mentioned. Do you currently live in any of these states? Do you have any stories or feedback you'd like to share? Your opinions help us come up with ideas for our next video. Leave a comment below and chat with me. Number 12. Massachusetts. Massachusetts, in the northeastern part of the United States, boasts beautiful landscapes with forests, hills, and a stunning coastline. Boston, the capital, is rich in history and culture. The state has about 7 million people. Despite its charm, Massachusetts saw a significant outmigration in the year 2023. According to United Van Lines, Massachusetts ranked as the seventh highest state for outbound moves in the year 2023. Approximately 56% of moves were people leaving, while only 43% were moving in. One major reason people are leaving is the high cost of living. In Boston, the median rent for a one-bedroom apartment is over $2,000 per month, which can be a huge burden for many residents. The high cost of buying a home is another factor, with the median home price in Boston around $600,000. The long, cold winters are also a deterrent. Massachusetts experiences heavy snowfall and frigid temperatures, prompting some residents to seek milder climates. Despite having many job opportunities, particularly in tech and education, some people leave to find jobs in other industries or areas with lower living costs. The state's traffic congestion, especially around Boston, adds to the stress of daily commutes. Retirees are also moving out, looking for states with warmer climates and lower taxes. States like Florida and Arizona are popular choices for their sunny weather and more affordable living. Number 11. Rhode Island. Rhode Island has just over 1 million residents, but approximately 2,120 people left the state, marking a small population decline of 0.19%. So why are so many people packing their bags? One major reason is the high cost of living, especially property taxes. For instance, Rhode Islanders can save thousands of dollars by moving to states like South Carolina or New Hampshire. The average property tax rate in Rhode Island is around 1.6%, which is significantly higher than the national average. For many retirees and families, the lower cost of living in other states is a big draw. The job market in Rhode Island also faces challenges. With limited job opportunities and lower wages compared to other regions, many residents struggle to find stable, well-paying jobs. This economic strain pushes people to look for better opportunities in states with stronger economies and more job prospects. Rhode Island's business climate has been criticized for its high taxes and regulatory burdens. These factors discourage businesses from setting up or expanding in the state, which in turn limits job opportunities for residents. While Rhode Island boasts a beautiful landscape and rich cultural experiences, some residents seek a better quality of life elsewhere. States with milder climates, lower costs of living, and more vibrant economic opportunities often attract those looking for a change. Number 10. West Virginia. West Virginia, known for its picturesque mountains and forests, has a landscape full of rolling hills, rivers, and valleys. It's a paradise for outdoor lovers who enjoy hiking and fishing. Despite its natural allure, West Virginia has seen a troubling population decline. As of July of the year 2023, the population was around 1,770,000, down by over 23,000 since April of the year 2020, 
This decline is driven by more deaths than births and a significant number of residents moving out. The collapse of the coal industry has led to high unemployment and poverty. Many residents have to leave to find better job opportunities. According to recent data, the median household income in West Virginia is only around $48,000, significantly lower than the national average. The state ranks very low in healthcare quality and access. West Virginia faces shortages of healthcare providers and high rates of uninsured residents, leading to poorer health outcomes. West Virginia has one of the lowest rates of adults with a college degree and a struggling K-12 education system. Only about 26% of adults have a bachelor's degree, compared to the national average of 32%. Many counties have experienced persistent poverty for decades. Over 16% of the population lives below the poverty line, which significantly impacts the quality of life and opportunities for advancement. The opioid epidemic has severely affected West Virginia, contributing to higher crime rates and straining social services. This ongoing issue has further destabilized communities and driven people away. Louisiana's cultural vibrancy and diverse landscapes make it a unique place to live. But why are thousands of people leaving this intriguing state? Stay tuned. Number 9. Louisiana. Louisiana, located in the southern United States, is renowned for its rich cultural heritage, blending French, Spanish, and Creole influences. The state's diverse landscape includes flat plains, swamps, and marshes, particularly in the southern regions. Despite its cultural vibrancy, Louisiana is facing a population decline. Louisiana's population decreased by approximately 16,500 people, continuing a trend from previous years. The state's population now stands at around 4.6 million. Several factors contribute to this ongoing outmigration. Louisiana's weak job market is a significant factor. The state's economy has not kept pace with the national average, showing little growth and even shrinking in some sectors. High poverty rates and limited economic diversification mean fewer job opportunities for residents. The state's unemployment rate is nearly one percentage point above the national average. Many residents leave in search of better job prospects and higher wages in neighboring states like Texas and Tennessee. Natural disasters are another major reason for the exodus. Louisiana is highly susceptible to hurricanes and flooding. The devastation caused by Hurricane Katrina in the year 2005 still lingers, and more recent storms continue to disrupt lives and prompt relocations. The constant threat of these disasters makes other regions seem safer and more stable. Louisiana also struggles with its education and healthcare systems. The state ranks low in educational outcomes, prompting families to move to states with better school systems. Healthcare services in Louisiana often fall short of residents' expectations, leading to further dissatisfaction. Parents particularly seek regions that offer better educational and healthcare facilities for their children. Lastly, the cost of living and safety concerns drive people away from Louisiana. While some areas are affordable, Others are plagued by high crime rates, making them less attractive. Residents seeking a safer environment and lower living costs find better options elsewhere. Number 8. Hawaii Hawaii is a beautiful state made up of several islands, each with its own unique charm. You'll find stunning beaches, lush forests, and towering volcanoes. The islands are perfect for outdoor activities like hiking, surfing, and snorkeling. Despite its natural beauty, about 11,193 people left Hawaii in the year 2023. This trend of outward migration has been ongoing due to several factors. First, Hawaii has one of the highest costs of living in the United States. Everyday expenses such as groceries, utilities, and housing are significantly more expensive compared to other states. For example, the average monthly rent for a one-bedroom apartment in Honolulu is over $2,000. This high cost of living makes it difficult for many families to make ends meet. Second, there's a severe shortage of affordable housing. Overregulation and restrictive zoning laws make it hard to build new homes, causing housing prices to skyrocket. The median home price in Hawaii is around $700,000, which pushes many residents to move to more affordable areas. Third, while tourism is a major industry in Hawaii, job opportunities in other sectors are limited. This lack of job diversity and relatively low wages add to the financial strain on residents. Additionally, Hawaii has high state taxes, which increase the financial burden. These taxes, combined with high living costs, make it challenging for many to save money or enjoy a comfortable lifestyle. Lastly, accessing quality healthcare can be difficult due to the geographic isolation of the islands. Many residents need to travel to the mainland for specialized medical care, 
adding to their expenses and inconvenience. Number 7. Mississippi. Mississippi is located in the southern part of the United States, renowned for its scenic forests, winding rivers, and lush farmland. The Mississippi River, one of the longest in the country, graces its western border, and the Gulf Coast offers sandy beaches and delicious seafood. Despite this natural beauty, the state's population is about 3 million, and it's shrinking rapidly. There are around 9,500 people left Mississippi. This continues a trend from recent years, with the state losing approximately 9,529 residents in the year 2022 and 8,555 in the year 2021. A major reason for this exodus is the lack of economic opportunities. Mississippi struggles to attract and retain businesses, resulting in fewer job prospects. High levels of regulation further hinder new business ventures and innovation. The state's education and healthcare systems are also problematic. Many rural areas have inadequate health services and underperforming schools, making it hard to attract and keep young families and professionals. For example, Mississippi ranks near the bottom in national education assessments and healthcare quality ratings. Mississippi is experiencing a natural decrease where the number of deaths exceeds births. This trend, combined with insufficient in migration, contributes significantly to the population decline. People are moving from rural areas to cities in search of better amenities. However, even urban areas like Jackson are losing residents due to socioeconomic issues. High crime rates and limited job opportunities in these cities exacerbate the problem. Number 6. Oregon. Oregon is in the Pacific Northwest and is famous for its beautiful landscapes, including mountains, forests, rivers, and beaches. Despite its natural beauty, Oregon's population, around 4.2 million, has been shrinking. An estimated 17,000 more people left the state than moved in. Why is this happening? Firstly, housing costs are sky high. The average monthly rent in Portland is about $1,600, making it hard for many to afford living here. Secondly, people are searching for better job opportunities elsewhere. Thirdly, the state has been grappling with rising homelessness and crime rates, which are significant concerns for residents. Lastly, natural disasters, particularly wildfires, have made life challenging. These issues are pushing people to seek better living conditions in other states. Sources like Oregon Public Broadcasting and local economic analysis reports highlight these trends and challenges. Pennsylvania offers a mix of urban and rural living with its scenic landscapes and bustling cities. However, it's facing a significant outmigration. Stay tuned. Number 5. Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania, often called PA, is known for its mix of big cities and beautiful countryside. The state has mountains, forests, and rivers, with the Appalachian Mountains running through the middle and the Delaware River to the east. With a population of about 13 million people, Pennsylvania offers a blend of urban and rural living. But why are around 119,000 people leaving Pennsylvania? Employment is a significant factor. Many people are seeking better job prospects in other states with stronger job markets and favorable business conditions. For instance, states like Texas and Florida are attracting residents due to their booming economies and job availability. The high cost of living, especially property taxes and housing expenses, is driving residents away. In Pennsylvania, the cost of living is about 8% higher than the national average, making it challenging for many to afford a comfortable lifestyle. Compare that to states with lower costs, like Tennessee, where the cost of living is 10% below the national average. Harsh winters in Pennsylvania prompt some residents to move to warmer states. Retirees, in particular, are heading south to enjoy milder climates and avoid the cold. States like Florida and Arizona are popular destinations for their warm weather and retiree-friendly communities. People also leave due to a lack of work-life balance. States offering flexible work options and remote work opportunities are appealing. For example, Colorado and Oregon have seen an influx of residents due to their progressive work policies and focus on quality of life. Number 4. Connecticut. Known for its rolling hills, forests, and beautiful coastline, Connecticut offers a mix of small towns and bustling cities like Hartford, New Haven, and Stamford. Despite its charm, Connecticut faces a significant outflow of residents. Connecticut's living expenses are among the highest in the country. For example, the average monthly rent for a two-bedroom apartment is around $2,000, which is significantly higher than the national average. Connecticut has some of the highest property and income taxes in the nation. The combined state and local tax burden is approximately 12%, pushing many to look for more tax-friendly states. 
the state has seen slow job growth and economic stagnation. From the year 1991 to the year 2020, Connecticut lost nearly 550,000 more people to other states than it gained. Recent years have continued this trend, with more residents seeking better job opportunities elsewhere. Connecticut's cold winters are another reason people leave. Many retirees and families prefer the warmer climates of states like Florida and South Carolina. Now, before we get to the final three states, if you could take just 10 seconds to hit the subscribe button, it would mean a lot to us. In return, we promise to keep making the show even more fantastic for you. Deal? Number three. New York. New York is famous for its vibrant city life, iconic landmarks, and diverse culture. The state is made up of five distinct parts Manhattan, Brooklyn, Queens, the Bronx, and Staten Island. Each of these areas has its own unique vibe and style, from the bustling streets of Manhattan to the quieter, more residential Staten Island. But despite its appeal, over 300,000 people left New York State. This continues a worrying trend of population decline, making New York one of the states with the highest out-migration rates in the country. So, what's driving people away? One of the main reasons is the high cost of living, especially housing expenses. In areas like New York City, the average home price is significantly above the national average, making it difficult for many residents to afford. For example, the average home price in New York City is over $500,000, compared to the national average of about $375,000. New York also has some of the highest state and local taxes in the country, which can be a burden for both individuals and businesses. High property taxes and income taxes make it hard for many to save and invest. Economic opportunities are another significant factor. Many people are moving to states with better job markets and lower unemployment rates. Upstate New York, in particular, has struggled with job losses and economic stagnation for years, making it less attractive for young professionals and families. Lastly, people are looking for a better quality of life. Many are seeking more space, a more relaxed lifestyle, and better weather. States with warmer climates and more outdoor activities are becoming increasingly attractive compared to the urban hustle of New York. Number 2. Illinois. With its bustling cities, quiet towns, and beautiful natural areas, Illinois has a lot to offer. The state is home to about 12.7 million people, making it the sixth most populated state in the country. But despite its attractions, Illinois is experiencing a significant exodus. Around 83,839 residents left Illinois for other states, one of the highest rates of domestic migration in the country. Illinois residents face some of the highest taxes in the nation, including property taxes, state income tax, and sales tax. Surveys consistently show that high taxes are the number one reason people consider leaving the state. Many people leave Illinois in search of better job opportunities. The state's economic policies and business climate have been criticized for not fostering growth, driving businesses and jobs elsewhere. The cost of living in Illinois, particularly in and around Chicago, can be very high. For example, the average monthly rent for a one-bedroom apartment in Chicago is around $2,000. This high cost of living pushes residents to seek more affordable options in other states. There is widespread dissatisfaction with the state government's performance, including budget management, public pensions and public services. Concerns about Illinois long-term financial health also drive people to look for more stable environments. Beyond economic reasons, some residents seek a better overall quality of life. They look for better weather, less congestion, and improved public safety. Neighboring states often attract Illinois residents with the promise of a quieter, safer, and more pleasant living experience. New Jersey, with its diverse landscapes and coastal beauty, is seeing an alarming rate of outbound moves. What major factors are pushing so many people to leave? Stay tuned. Number 1. New Jersey. New Jersey is in the northeastern part of the United States and has a mix of beautiful landscapes, including beaches, forests, and mountains. The Atlantic Ocean borders it to the east, offering great coastal views and activities. The state has a diverse population of about 9 million people. Despite its beauty, New Jersey saw a significant number of residents leaving. Around 70% of moves were outbound, making it the state with the highest rate of people moving out. Why are so many leaving? Let's break it down. Firstly, the high cost of living is a major factor. New Jersey has some of the highest property taxes in the nation, which can be a big financial burden for homeowners. On average, property taxes in New Jersey are about 2.5% of the home value. For a house worth $300,000, 
that's $7,500 a year. Secondly, besides property taxes, New Jersey has high state income and sales taxes. The state income tax can be as high as 10.75% for top earners, making it hard for people to save money or enjoy a comfortable lifestyle. Weather is another reason people are leaving. New Jersey experiences a full range of seasons, including hot summers and cold winters. Some people prefer to move to states with milder climates, especially retirees looking for warmer weather. States like Florida and Arizona are popular for their sunny and warm climates, attracting many former New Jersey residents. The job market also plays a role. While New Jersey has many job opportunities, some people move to other states with stronger job markets or more job growth in specific industries. For example, tech professionals might move to states like California or Texas for better opportunities. Finally, let's talk about traffic and commuting. New Jersey is known for heavy traffic, especially around major cities like Newark and Jersey City. Long commutes and traffic congestion can make daily life stressful and time-consuming, pushing people to seek less congested areas. If you found today's video interesting, don't hesitate to hit the like button and subscribe to the Discover Globe channel. Your support is very important to us. Be sure to check out the next video appearing on your screen. You're sure to love the content we bring. Please leave a comment about which country you'd like us to explore next. Thank you for watching and see you in the latest video. Thanks for being with us on this great journey. Leave your thoughts in the comments and like to help us. Remember to subscribe for more. See you soon.